we have to talk about memes because memes is one of the top two narratives together with AI of this current cycle. I'm a huge proponent of memes because I think this is the gateway to crypto. Memes are easy to understand. Anyone can buy them. Uh, you can buy them right now on Revolut, Robinhood and Coinbase and different other apps. So it's super easy to buy. You don't have to buy them on chain. Uh, so it's very, very easy. And on top of that, they are very easy to understand. There's no complicated technology. It's all about cute uh, animals most of the time, cute dogs, cute kitties, cute frogs like Pepe. Uh, so it's very easy to understand. And I think this is one of the easiest narratives to play into. Uh, of course, current prices are very interesting as well. This is not a financial advice, nothing here is, only my opinions. So let's get started with looking at the top five. So first of all, you have two coins on the top two places, Dogecoin and Shiba Inu, that are here from the previous bull market. And actually with the case of Dogecoin, from the previous, previous bull markets. So Dogecoin is the probably the OG meme coin, uh, the one that was created as a fork of Bitcoin. So it has a similar structure. Uh, all the other coins were created on other blockchains. So Shiba Inu lives on Ethereum, Pepe lives on Ethereum, Bonk lives on Solana, Dog with Hat lives on Solana. So Dogecoin is the only one that has its own blockchain. So the current market cap is $20 billion for Dogecoin. That's amazing, but it's still far away from when it was at the top. If you were to look, so let's go directly into the Dogecoin. Uh, if you were to look how high it went in the previous bull market, we go with the max, then you can see that it went to almost or over $80 billion, almost $90 billion at some point, And we we're here at the very beginning. Uh, if this uh, this cycle is really the beginning of the bull market and everything seems like it is, then basically we might be for a nice surprise. Uh, because with retail coming, people will be buying easy to buy narratives and Dogecoin is definitely one of them. Uh, but if you were to look at other coins, then basically you have Shiba Inu. Ship is was created in the previous bull market. As you can see, it has also grown quite a lot uh, in the past couple of days. Uh, but also if we zoom out, then you can see that we're from far from the top. If you look at the market cap, then basically the, the top market cap was something around $40 billion. Uh, currently, Shiba sits at around 12, 13 billion dollars. So there is still a potential if we are to reach, of course, uh, the previous highs, which is not guaranteed because there are different runners up and they are really interesting. And I wanted to talk about them. Uh, there are three of them, Pepe, Bonk and Dog with Hat. So starting with Pepe, which is really uh, interesting because Pepe is really this meme of crypto Twitter. Everyone on crypto Twitter is using some kind of Pepe memes. Uh, I'm myself quite a fan. And usually this Pepe came out of nothing. There, there were different Pepe tokens uh, even before this Pepe, because of course Pepe is such a meme. So people were creating different Pepes over and over and over again. However, nothing gets so much traction like this Pepe. And it launched uh, basically previous year, uh, spawned the entire uh, small meme coin bull market. And basically people went crazy. It went to 1.2, 1.3 billion dollar market cap back then when Binance listed it. That was basically the top. Then it retraced to around uh, 400 million dollars. And now it's back and actually it went through the previous highs because if you were to look at it, it's currently at uh, $2 billion. It's around $2 billion. It touched $2 billion for a, a brief moment. Currently sits at around 1.9 uh, and this is really the uh, ATH. Uh, as you can see, the previous high was around 1.5. This is the, the moment of the Binance listing. Uh, it got quite a career with basically going from zero to 1.5 within the, the span of probably like three weeks altogether. I think it, it launched basically beginning of April. Uh, this is not shown here on CoinGecko and basically it's listed on most of the uh, on most of the exchanges right now. So this might really be the winner coin uh, for the for the next bull market because basically so many people know about Pepe. This is a meme that goes uh, around uh, for uh, quite some time uh, and also this basically is anointed at this point to be the Pepe meme coin. Uh, there are many others, of course, that are uh, co coming to the market, but this one seems to be uh, the, the, the best one and it will be very hard to beat this $2 billion market cap. Two other coins are very interesting because the other one is Bonk, uh, which is uh, which was creating as a joke on uh, Solana and for quite a long time, it actually sit at a pretty low price until 
uh, basically we had a resurgence of Solana uh, and with that we also had uh, people buying Solana phones because it happens that many phones were coming with the airdrop of Bong, which was super interesting. So as you can see for a long time, it's, it's, it basically sat at around $20 million market cap. You could buy it for very cheap uh, for a, basically a year. Nobody was interested in that. And then suddenly it went straight to $1.5 billion market cap, same as Pepe. And for quite a long time, it was above Pepe. Right now it's uh, again at $1.5 billion market cap. Pepe is a little bit higher than that, but basically they, they are competing for this uh, for third spot when it comes to the biggest uh, meme coins on, on the market right now. So super interesting stuff. And then on the number, uh, on the place number five, we have Doc with Hat, which is a newer creation on, uh, which basically came out of nothing, uh, out of nowhere. And basically it was just created uh, in December. Basically it was created after Bonk uh, started gaining traction. People were uh, missing on Bonk. So they created other Doc coins. Uh, and basically Doc with Hat was that creation. It, it w went after the meme of Doc with a Hat Hat, and basically uh, it was a funny play on that and suddenly it reached this 1.3 uh, million dollar market cap there is also additional narrative that because there are 1 million dog with hat tokens 1 billion dog with hat tokens so if uh, we go to 1 dollar this was uh, basically the narrative behind some of the price movement we want to make dog with hat go to 1 dollar and that would be 1 billion dollar market cap which is also very interesting so this is the the uh, one of the free coins that were just a new entrance to the meme coin category as you can see there are a couple of from the other ones uh, we have also maga trump coin here uh, that are newer uh, we have when token uh, coming from jupiter exchange uh, we have pepe fork uh, pork coming after uh, coming this year and then we are, we have a couple of interesting ones that I'm going to mention here because they are either on the rise or uh, they have fallen for a, a bit more so I was already reviewing on my channel at some point Harry Potter of uh, Obama Sonic 10 Inu uh, with the short name being Bitcoin super cool uh, name super cool memes and basically the the team behind it is really doing quite a lot uh to uh, you know hold the token hold the memes there are many people on crypto twitter talking constantly about it and it's coming back so i would expect that the price of that would also uh basically at least hold or go up again not a financial advice here i'm only talking about the coins i like and i'm I do have some Harry Potter Obama Sonic 10 Inu at this point, so uh, I really think these memes are really funny. So this is one of the uh, one of the things I'm looking at. Uh, there's a very new uh, coin as well, which is much smaller. That was mentioned on Crypto Banter, uh, you, and it basically went parabolic from from that time. This is called Hamul. Hamul is basically you probably won't be able to see the the market cap, but. Uh, Hamul is a very new coin as well. It was created, the name is after the, the cat of Vitalik. So we don't have really many cat coins. Most of them are dog coins for some reason. Uh, even though there are many people that prefer cats. Uh, so Hamul is one of the cat coins and it seems to be on the rise. Maybe it is the one uh, cat coin that will exist. Of course, there are many others, but we don't really have them in the top uh, top 50 of the of different meme coins. Uh, you have this parabolic rise here. It's still pretty low when it comes to market cap, I think, because last time I checked on like Dex tools, I think the market cap was around 30 or $40 million. Uh, so this is basically uh, this is basically the the Hamil co coin. So it's far away from the highs of, for example, Pepe and other coins. Of course, it doesn't mean it will ever reach them. However, uh, the the funny stuff here is that it's not really listed on any uh, any marketplace. So you can only buy it on chain for now, which is huge because if any uh, the, the exchange will decide to list it, then basically it's guaranteed probably that uh, the price will go up. For these coins again not a financial advice this can uh, not happen there can be other uh, things other factors that will make the price go down so of course you have to do your research before investing but definitely have hamul on your watch list it's very interesting and many more people are talking about it so uh, it also makes sense uh, also the token i wanted to mention that is probably under talked uh, 
is uh, Voyak. So Voyak is basically one of those uh, other Pepe, Pepe-like memes. Uh, this is Pepe, basically Chat, Voyak are, I think, the top three memes that people are reposting, and especially with Voyak uh, or Wojak, depending on where do you come from, uh, is one of the top memes because people are often uh, showing different Voyak memes when it comes to losses, and they show it uh, basically. Uh, to say that, you know, uh, it will be fine in the end, but it's not really fine right now. Uh, and Voyak coin is basically the one Voyak coin that basically appeared the same time that Pepe appeared, uh, but didn't get that much traction. I think the highs where you can see the highs, they were at around 60 million dollar market cap. So definitely much, much, much smaller than Pepe. However, uh, those highs are uh, slowly coming back. As you can see, the token was traded for like at around $5 million market cap for a really long time time and it's starting to get traction right now. It's still pretty small, still got a, go a lot of gains in the past couple of days, but it's definitely on the smaller side right now. Worth taking a look at, uh, also one of my favorites when it comes to different meme coins. Uh, and. <clears throat> there are definitely a lot of others. There's a lot of others of coins coming on either Solana or Ethereum mainnet. I think Ethereum mainnet tokens are especially interesting because uh, because of the g high gas fees, th this is future in this case, because of the high gas fees, people are selling them less and they are holding them longer. And also it makes uh, sense because once they started to be traded on different ex centralized exchanges, when you have no gas, they basically go parabolic. So this is a very nice narrative. And if you can catch one of them, then basically this is how you, ca you can make it this cycle. Memes and AI. This is probably what I would go after. Uh, of course, again, not a financial advice. You should do your research. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to the channel and follow the links down below uh, to trade these meme coins on different exchanges.